Hi, this is Adam, and thank you for watching Sabina Reefing. Today we have a quick tank vlog update, and we'll be going over UV and some of the issues I've been having in the fish tank, such as ick. So let's get into the video, and hopefully I can help you out with a couple things. So due to the ick outbreak, I'm going to be installing a UV filter to try and help reduce, does not eliminate, but reduce the pathogen, the parasite. So I'm going to take this pipe right here, which is my return, off of my core 15. I'm going to take that off and I'm going to plumb it up to the filter, which is probably going to be on this beam right here, and then plumb it back into the core. So that should help reduce the protozoan. So, it's plumbed, all the fittings are tightened up, the bulb's in, make sure when you're handling the bulb, don't touch the glass, period, and also wear gloves, so I've done both. Um, everything's plumbed up, tightened up, well, truth, make sure we got no leaks. The UV is not on, obviously, so it'll start pumping here in one second. So, got water going through the UV. It's not on, but let it run like this for a minute or two. Just make sure everything's okay. Uh, I'm going to do some programming so that the UV is only on when the return pump's on. If I have a fault or an error or the return pump's turned off or anything else, that it shuts the UV down. So the next thing I need to do is figure out how many gallons per hour I need my return pump for, which appears to be about 1,000 to 1,200 gallons an hour according to the chart that they have for getting rid of fish pathogens in a saltwater aquarium. So I've completely closed both of my main drains. And so the only thing that will be open is the emergency drain, which is all the way at the top. So it should fill up the overflow boxes and then it'll take and start filling up the tank. I'm gonna measure how many inches from start down to finish, somewhere around here. Uh, it is, calculate the volume of the box, divide by the time, and I have my gallons per hour. Along with helping with ick or parasitic infections, you may notice another side effect that really was a big benefit inside the fish tank is that the uh, diatoms that you saw on the rocks uh, pretty much disappeared in one to two days. Uh, I've shot this over the course of a couple weeks, but you notice that it's pretty much gone in the first one scene. So it was a really nice benefit. Thank you for watching. I hope this was helpful. And please click the like and subscribe button. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comments below.